about to get sent out your merch if you haven't copped already the link is always in the description you guys i have a bag full of it right here shout out to everybody been ordering on lucianotv.com place your order today the link is in the description also if you want to enter to our hundred dollar giveaway every friday that we have go to luchigang.com and enter to win tomorrow's payday if you did not know super nauseous and tired you guys this pregnancy is taking a toll on me you know what's funny before i was pregnant like that's what i would always want to eat like vietnamese asian food some like chinese and that or italian and he never wanted that and nowadays like i feel like he's getting my taste buds like he wants everything that i usually would want like what like vietnamese like what is it that, like ranch? He doesn't even, he, does, oh, I he want never ranch. wants that? ranch. Yeah, you're right about that. And he like was like, I'm tasting ranch. And that is usually me that wants ranch. So we're thinking we're gonna go to Mai's cause there's no other restaurant that can do it like Mai's. Before we start the video, I just wanna give a big shout out to Miss Kelly Jean for doing her thing yesterday on the YouTube blast cause I was uh, caught up and I wasn't gonna be able to do it yesterday. So shout out to her for doing her thing for the ladies and her comadres. And ladies, if y'all wanna see more Kelly Jean, subscribe to her YouTube channel, Kelly Jean Blogs. And once she hit a thousand subscribers, she gonna post her own video, right? Or when you gonna do it? I don't know. The reason why um, I don't usually post like videos like yesterday is because I know that the channel that we have now, the channel TV, is like a family thing or like mainly guys. I don't know. I, I'm just assuming, but that's the reason why. And I don't want to do many of these videos on this channel because I want to grow my own channel specifically for ladies. So, like makeup and all that, you know, boring stuff that dudes don't want to see but the girls seem to like it. Y'all go to Kelly Jean Vlogs for all that good stuff. She will be back next Wednesday with another vlog for the ladies. So y'all stay tuned for next Wednesday. Tell the compadres not to hate. Tell them, babe, they'll listen to you. Baby, you gotta take your emotions out of it. You know what I'm saying? We just collecting data. We throwing it against the wall, seeing what sticks. You know what I'm saying? So let me tell y'all something. In business, you gotta remove your emotions. It's all about numbers. You gotta take away your feelings and emotions and get to the bag sometimes people yeah i've done it before and i know a lot and especially in the rap game rappers they can let their emotions and feelings get in the way of the bag let me give you an example oh i don't like this dude i don't like the way he moved but that dude got a big following and the dude might want to work with you but you letting your feelings and emotions get in the way of doing some business together with this person that could potentially bring a bag you know what i'm saying so you got to get to the check man and it's all about the money and then you got to leave your feelings and emotions out of business you know when you go to work you don't go to work to make friends with your co-workers they're not friends you want to make friends go home to your uh, spouse and your kids and be friends with them but when you're at work you're there to get the job done you're not there to make friends the same thing in the rap game it's the same thing in the, if you're in, a, in the entrepreneur world and you're a businessman of your for yourself working for yourself self-employed there ain't no heartbeat in business it's all about the numbers you know what i mean but i ain't gonna uh go too too much into this spill because you're driving and she gets so upset when i'm driving and on my phone and swerving out of my lane swerving a suburban 
Type in the comments if you know what album that song was on. Swerving or Suburban. Shout out to my boy Blocker Rock. I think you just gave it away. No, Blocker Rock is the dude singing on the hook and made, who made the beat. Oh. But that ain't what album it was on. Type in the comments if you know what album it was on. First person to tell me what album that was on, I'm going to send you a free shirt. Don't forget, go to luchagang.com and enter to win this $100 giveaway we're doing every Friday. Tomorrow's payday. And if you haven't copped your merch, go to LucianoTV.com and cop your merch. We got everything in stock, and we're still coming out with that winter line apparel real soon. Sweatshirts and hoodies on the way. So I'm just waiting till I get rid of all these t-shirts I got. So y'all go on, buy these t-shirts, and then we're going to come out with our winter line. Yeah, right now we're on our way to go get this good old Vietnamese food at Mize. If you're from Houston, you probably know about Mize, but if you ain't from Houston, and you come to Houston and you want some good authentic Vietnamese food, go to Mize downtown, Google it for the address. Midtown, Midtown downtown, same thing. the back of the building because the parking is in the back like he is currently getting baby Houston out the car check out his swag for the day though Houston is matching with him he's wearing oh, yeah, his we cowboy man. boots we got his cowboy boots on you like my what is it OOTD outfit of the day shirt by Ralph Lauren Brooks Brothers shorts and Gucci on my feet. What about Houston's cowboy boots? Ostrich on his feet. He rocking that ostrich. Ostrich boots with the Nike shoes. <laughs> what the hell? Y'all, Myers is like one of my top five favorite spots in Houston. They have some bomb food. I like it too, it's just too damn far. Well, we live far. You just woke up? <laughs> you just woke up? Houston just woke up. He was asleep. Thank you. What happened, boy? <laughs> he just woke up. Wow, the boot. Yeah, he got his cowboy boots. Vietnamese egg rolls. <laughs> He's like, get the camera off me. <laughs> you always want to do that. Because you when eat I'm, so when funny. I'm so cool, put the camera on when I'm <laughs> go, baby. Go, baby. Take a big bite. I don't know, son. <laughs> Damn, it's gone. <laughs> I'm about to enjoy this. These are our appetizers. We already put in our order, but whenever we get our food, I am gonna make sure to record that and show y'all what we got. Oh, well, Licky wants to show y'all how to eat the Vietnamese egg roll. This is mint, right? Yeah, it's mint and then lettuce. And cilantro. And then you put a little bit of cilantro and you wrap it. Then you dip it and bite it. It's so delicious. They actually brought our food out really, really quick. I was barely digging into my egg roll. And I got the steak medallions. These right here are so bomb. This right here makes it 10 times better. With some white rice. Look at Lucky's plate, you guys. Like, 
I don't think this camera does it any justice. It's huge. So big. He hasn't stopped eating since we got our food. Yummy. Look at these Vietnamese tortillas. Made out of rice. It's called rice paper. You gotta dip it in water. Hot water. That's not how it's supposed to look, you guys. <laughs> Disclaimer, we don't know how to do it. You're not supposed to dip it a lot. And so basically, that's how you wrap your meat and rice and everything in it. Damn, boy, you ain't even cut the meat. It's like, do that bad boy right there. Most of my food. There's only like two, three little pieces left. We're trying to finish this egg roll, but it's just a little bit too much for me right now. He was not playing. That boy took everything. I need, I need sauce too. You ready? Yeah, I can't even close it. Houston's still eating his spring roll. That's crazy. Okay. I, I was just tripping. I'm, I'm driving downtown, and every person we pass got a phone in their hand. Phone in his hand. Phone in her hand. Everybody got a phone in their hand. And these business people don't, because they walking with a group of people. But everybody that's by themselves got a phone in their hand. It won't be long before that phone is implanted in us. Y'all watch. Next 10, 20 years, they're going to make it where we don't even got to carry around this phone. And then that's when the human will evolve into cyborg. Cyborg? Cyborg. Lucky Clops. Damn, imagine if you could do that, if you could just access Google. You would know everything. That's when our brains, our heads gonna swell up like an alien and we're gonna be having big ass heads. Cause we're gonna know everything. Everything that Google know, we'll have it in us already. We'll be, we'll be online. We'll be online creatures. Houston is inspired. made it back to our side of town and look at baby Kelly Jane you sleeping baby Houston you awake oh you up and at him huh whoa 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 Okay.